Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss the remaining questions of NEET 2018. In previous video, we discussed some questions with detailed solution and proved with NCRT biology textbook. From the previous video itself, it is clear that you can crack your need by studying biology NCRT textbook. So read each and every word in your textbook and crack your ultimate goal. In this video, we are continuing with the question answering section. Those who missed the previous video, please do watch. So let's discuss some questions. Question number 101. So let's look. The correct order of steps in polymerase chain reaction, PCR is, let's look the option, option number 1, denaturation, extension, annealing, option number 2, annealing, extension, denaturation, option number 3, extension, denaturation, annealing, option number 4, denaturation, annealing, extension. So, this is a direct question. If we know the order, we can directly answer the question. So, the answer is denaturation, annealing, extension because in polymerized chain reaction three steps have been taking place denaturation trimer annealing and extension of trimers next question select the correct match let's look the options option number one th morgan transduction option number two f2 crossed with the recessive parent dihybrid cross Option number 3, ribozyme, nucleic acid. Option number 4, grigor johann mendel transformation. So, in this question, they are asked, select the correct match. So, the correct match in this question is option number 3 ribozyme nucleic acid because ribozyme is a catalytic RNA which is a nucleic acid these nucleic acid behave as an enzymes let's look what other options are T.H. Morgan is a Nobel Prize winner who proposed chromosome theory of heredity. Second option, F2 generation cross with the recessive parent is not a dihybrid cross. And option number four, Grigor Johann Mendel is the father of genetics. So the correct match for this question is ribozyme nucleic acid. Next question. A new variety of rice was patented by a foreign company. Though such variety have been present in India for a long time. This is related to, let's look the options. Option number 1, Lerma Rojo. Option number 2, Sharbadi Sonaro. Option number 3, CO667. And option number 4, Basmadi. This is a direct question. This is given as such in your textbook. So, the answer is Basmadi. This is a sentence given in your NCRT textbook. Uh, CO667 is also a rice variety uh, but Larma Rojo and Sharbadi Sonaro is a variety of wheat. Next question. Which of the following pairs is strongly matched? Let's look the options. Option number 1 exotype sex grasshopper determination. Option number 2 ABO blood grouping codominance. Option number 3 starch synthesis in P multiple alleles. Option number 4 TH Morgan linkage. So here we have to answer which of the following pairs is strongly matched. So let's look the option one by one. Exotype sex, uh, sex is a grasshopper determination because grasshopper is having only one X chromosome so option one is true let's look the option number two abo blood grouping codominance because abo blood grouping is an example for codominance so the option number two is also true let's look option number four th morgan th morgan proposed the chromosome theory of linkage so uh, option number four is also correct the wrongly patched uh, pair is option number three starts synthesis in p multiple alleles because starts synthesis in p involve a single gene exhibit a multiple phenotypic expression so that gene is called the pleiotropic gene not the multiple alleles so here the wrongly matched pair is option number three next question Select the correct statement. Let's look the options. Option number one, spliceosome take part in translation. Option number two, Punnett square was developed by a British scientist. Option number three, Franklin Stoll coined the term linkage. Option number four, transduction was discovered by S. Altman. Here we have to select the correct statement. So the correct statement here is Punnett square was developed by a British scientist. So let's look what other statements refers. Uh, 
option number one splices on take part in translation the uh, statement is wrong because splices on take part in post transcriptional changes in eukaryotes let's look option number three franklin stoyle coined the term linkage it's the wrong statement franklin stoyle proved semi-conservative mode of replication option number four transduction was discovered by s altman is a wrong statement transduction was discovered by cinder and later book next question the experimental proof for semi-conservative replication of DNA was first shown in. This is a direct question. We all know what this answer is. Option number one, plant. Option number two, bacterium. Option number three, fungus. Option number four, virus. So the answer is bacterium because it is proven that DNA replicates semi-conservatively and it was first shown in Escherichia coli and subsequently in higher organisms such as plants, Matthew Meselson and Frank install perform the following experiment in 1958 let's look the next question which of the following flowers only once in its lifetime let's look the options option number one mango option number two jackfruit option number three bamboo species option number four papaya so this is a direct question and the answer is bamboo species because bamboo species exhibit a unusual flowering phenomena and these species flower only once in their lifetime generally after 50 to 100 years produce large number of fruits and then die while other options mango jackfruit papaya are polycarpic fruits they produce flower and fruits many time in the lifetime so next question offsets are produced by let's look the options option number one parthenocarpy option number two mitotic division option number three meiotic division option number four parthenogenesis what is offset offset is a vegetative propagule so the answer is by mitotic division the process involved is asexual so the asexual reproduction takes place by mitotic division so the offsets are produced by mitotic division while other option let's look what other options are what is parthenocarpy parthenocarpy is a fruit formed without fertilization giving seedless fruit what is meiotic division here in this options in this question meiotic division do not take place because meiotic division do not occur in somatic cells what is parthenogenesis parthenogenesis is the formation of embryo from ovum or egg without fertilization next question Select the correct match. So let's look the option Matthew Meselson and Franklin Stoll, Paisam Satevam. Option number two, Alfred Hershey and Martha Chase, Tobacco Mosaic Virus. Option number three, Alec Jeffries, Streptococcus pneumonia. And option number four, Franco S. Jacob and Jacques Monod, Lack of Prone. This is a direct question. If you know the answer, we can directly answer the question. So the answer is Franco S. Jacob and Jacques Monod, Lack of Prone. Let's look what other options also Matthew Meselson and Franklin Stoll propose semi-conservative DNA replication in E. coli. Alfred Hershey and Martha Chase proved DNA as a genetic material. Alec Jeffreys proposed DNA fingerprinting technique. Next question. Which of the following proved helpful in preserving pollen as fossils? Let's look the options. Option number one, oil content. Option number two, cellulose content. Option number three, pollen kit. Option number four, sporopollen. This is a direct question and the answer is sporopollen because pollen grains are well preserved as fossil because the presence of Sporopollen. Well, look, why, let's look what other options. Oil content. Oil content do not have any role in preservation of pollen as fossils cellulose kindan is the inner sporodermal layer of uh, pollen grain and pollen kit helps in insect pollination so next question natality refers to let's look the option number of individuals leaving the habitat option number two birth rate option number three death rate option number four number of individual entering a habitat it is a direct question so we know what is natality natality refers to birth rate 
next question world ozone day is celebrated on this is a general question if you know the date you can directly answer the question so let's look the option option number 1 16th september option number 2 21st april option number 3 5th june option number 4 22nd april so world ozone day is celebrated on 16th september let's look what other days are we know what is 5th june is a world environment day what is 21st april is the national yellow bad day what is 22nd april it is the national earth day next question which of the following is a secondary pollutant let's look the options option number one sulfur dioxide option number two carbon dioxide option number three carbon monoxide option number four o three so which is a secondary pollutant O3 is a secondary pollutant also these are formed by the reaction of primary pollutants what are the primary pollutants sulfur dioxide carbon dioxide carbon monoxide next question niche is what is niche let's look the options the range of temperature that an organism need to live option number two the physical space where an organism live option number three or the biological factors in the organism's environment option number four the functional role played by the organism where it lives so it is a direct question which is the functional role played by an organism where it lives so thank you. In this video only few questions are answered. Remaining questions with detailed solution will be uploaded soon. So if you like this video please like, subscribe and share this video to your friends. Stay tuned and stay subscribed for upcoming uploads.